seems like the old ways are the most reliable after all. Mung, are you done preparing our promotional materials? Ah, uh, my apologies. I'm only about halfway through. Do you really think they will be effective? Trust me, they're going to work wonders. This marketing strategy has been used by Wangsheng Funeral Parlor for generations. Clients in need come to our door and write down their commissions on blank wooden tiles. Then they squeeze those inside the parlor through the crack under the door. I fulfill the request written on each tile to make sure our clients are satisfied with the service, no matter if it's an obituary, cremation, or funeral that they seek. Although, it is a bit of a hassle with the constant back and forth. If only we could burn them by the batch. No, Director, I'm not asking about the wooden tiles themselves, but about the special offer they advertise. <laughs> Wangsheng Funeral Parlor should keep up with the times. Just think about it. If we don't attract new clients, we'll be left with nothing, won't we? Business development is a crucial element of every prosperous enterprise. I've been trying various marketing strategies ever since I became the director. I put up posters just like all the other shops, but the Millilith promptly removed them. Then I organized the Wangsheng Visitor's Day, but no one showed up. Well, that doesn't come as a huge surprise. And finally, I discovered that the traditional ways are the most reliable after all. I took inspiration from the wisdom of previous directors. So now, I go from door to door looking for people and organizations willing to cooperate. Just like during our visit to the Adventurers Guild. That's what I mean by business development. The other method I'm trying is using the wooden tiles as coupons. Just by writing things like, buy one get one free for the holder of this tile on them. Ugh. What do they buy and what do they get? A solid and durable second home, of course. Well, they may not need it right away, but they can be sure that when they do, it will still be as good as new. <clears throat> it won't start deteriorating before you finish doing so yourself. That's the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor Quality Guarantee. All right, Mung. Keep adding those special offers to the wooden tiles. The future of our business depends on it. <sighs> I'm still not sure this will work. Oh, I get it. You think that our special offer is not comprehensive enough, right? It is true. I was offering all kinds of great benefits to the Adventurers Guild because they are a new client. But in doing so, I neglected my old clients. <sighs> You're right. It's unfair. Hmm. Let me do some market research. Wait here, my faithful assistants. I'll be back with you in a moment. It shouldn't take too long. Paimon already told you we're not your assistants! <sighs> Guess we got dragged into somebody else's business again. Let's look around while she's away. You must be the director's new hires. Not us! We're just very curious about Wangsheng Funeral Parlor and Hu Tao. Well, I wouldn't get too curious if I were you. Too much knowledge isn't good for ordinary folk. The director is tactful when it comes to what should and shouldn't be known. Her? Tactful? We should get going. Let's go find Hu Tao. Settled then? Write it like this. Wangsheng Funeral Parlor Bumper Sale. Buy one, get one free. Buy two, get three free. More for your Mora. <laughs> I love it. Better than all that lifeless brochure stuff. <laughs> we 
we want people to feel warm and fuzzy. Uh, but, Director, isn't Lifeless the name of the game in this industry? That's old hat. We're opening up new ground. Why does Wangshu Funeral Parlor need to open up? Uh, <sighs> yes, Director. Poor guy's giving up. Right, we should get going. I am not letting new business escape us. We? <sighs> As in us. <laughs> Who else? Do you see anyone else around here? Oh, well, you probably wouldn't see them if there was. Stop adding little afterthoughts like that! It creeps people out. <laughs> Just a joke, sorry. Everything you see is everything that's present. For the moment, at least. Uh, lighten up. The way I see it, people make death scarier than it really is. What people truly fear about departing this world is suffering and regret. To deal with the trauma, they let their imaginations run wild with notions of ghosts and evil spirits. <sighs> oh, baseless fantasies. What we've ended up with is a topic that people are morbidly afraid of talking about. If I don't broach the subject, then Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor won't be long for this world. Oh, more approachable and appeasable than you'd imagined? Well, Paima wouldn't say that. Let's just say at least it didn't hurt us. You must have come across a particularly ferocious entity. How should I put this? Most spirits are incapable of harming ordinary folks. The job of Wangsheng Funeral Parlor is to guard the border between life and death. One component of this is correcting notions of death and the afterlife that people may hold. Simply put, for those unable to see the border, they're best kept as far away from it as possible. So for ordinary folks, the best case scenario is ignorance of all matters concerning spirits in the afterlife, or even better, a belief that none of it exists. Then you really don't have any excuse for spooking the heck out of people. <laughs> you make it sound so abominable. I'm just trying to get them to see the humor in it all. I never thought you'd be such a bore. Never mind. If you stick by me, everything will become clear. All right, let's get going. Follow me. Director, wait. What about Big G? Don't forget. Big G? Who's that? We've been in Lila for ages and never heard that name. Oh, nothing. Just something Mung's been pleading with me to take care of. Should be a piece of cake. Where are we going? To visit an important potential client. I'll lead the way. Uh, sorry, who are you? Hello, I'm Hu Tao, director of the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. Okay, so why would someone from Wangsheng Funeral Parlor be looking for me? Mm, nothing major. How are you feeling these days? Any aches or pains? You shouldn't ignore them, by the way. Very often they're an omen of something terminal. When we're healthy, it's easy to forget the crushing fragility of life. So, aches and pains, best to keep an eye on them. What are you getting at? I'm in great health and enjoying life very much, thank you. Go and find some other poor soul. Goodbye. <sighs> Why did they get angry? What's wrong with a few earnest health tips? Hyman thinks it's because they're coming from the director of a funeral parlor!
And you are. Be quick. I'm busy. Hello there. Would you be interested in understanding a bit about our services at the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor? Wangsheng Funeral Parlor? Uh, I'm not in need of your services. So you're out here looking for new customers? Don't you think this might be a bit of a crass way of going about it? Hardly. Isn't this the fashion these days? Bring the service to the customer and all that. I'm not sure it's every service that falls into that. Uh, anyway, please bother someone else if you don't mind. Ugh, another failure. Still, not the end of the world. Pilot's curious. Does this approach ever work out for you? I know your face. The Wangsheng Funeral Parlor Director, right? I'm sorry, I'm really in no need of it. Don't apologize, get to know us. We've got a new sale going on. Ever hear the saying, out with the old, in with the new? Well, going out with a bang is the best way to start off in style on the other side. <laughs> if you keep talking like this, I'll have to call the Millilith. No, no, no. Okay, relax. We're leaving. But Wangsheng Funeral Parlor awaits your distinguished patronage. You really don't give up, do you? Hmm? Are you trying to make me feel better? Well, thank you. Seems you understand me far better than most people. Not really. This is just getting really uncomfortable. <laughs> Business development? Is that what you see this as? Surely you don't think all that was business development. Then what was it exactly? Traumatization for its own sake? <laughs> no, no, no. The business development ended after the discussion with the Adventurers Guild. <laughs> I was helping to find somebody for Mung. You remember Big G? As it turns out, the Big G that Mung is looking for is a ghost adrift in the mortal realm. The three we saw just now were all people I suspected of being followed by Big G. But having seen them, I didn't sense the presence of anything otherworldly. So we just had a quick chat, and I left it at that. Why didn't you say so? Paimon thought you had some kind of sixth sense for, uh, people in declining health. Huh? What would I need that kind of ability for? I'm no doctor. <laughs> Were you seriously hoping that the director of the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor was going to start healing people? Or... Paimon was trying to subtly imply that... Uh, never mind. Paimon wouldn't know how to explain subtlety in a way you'd understand. Well, let's leave that for now and head back to Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. This Big G matter is very closely linked to Meng. <laughs> <laughs>